when you are selling your products on Amazon and you want to advertise your product on Amazon platform so people can actually see your product, click on your product listing and purchase your product. So you can actually get more money and you can actually rank your product on the keyword which people are searching on Amazon who want to purchase your product. So basically if you want to run your Amazon advertising campaign effectively then you need to learn like how Amazon will show your ads to your audience. And once you learn this, once you understand this concept, then it will be so easy for you to run your Amazon PPC campaign effectively and get the most results out of it, right? So basically Amazon is a website and there are mainly three placements, three places where Amazon will show your ad once you start running your campaign. And the three placements are top of the search, rest of the search and product placement, right? So basically these are the three places where Amazon will display your ad when you start running your ad campaign for your product. Right? So for example, you are selling lemon squeezer. So if a person who want to purchase lemon squeezer from Amazon, he will go to Amazon website, search for that product and click enter. And when they search for the product, so they will be able to see multiple sellers selling the same product. And after searching on top of the search, they will see some advertisement. So basically this place, this placement is called top of the search where there is a high chances for people to purchase a product from. Right? But for example, if they don't purchase from the top of the page and then they keep scrolling down on the same page, so at the bottom and at the middle, they will see some ads as well. And that second place is called rest of the page placement. And this is also a placement where Amazon actually shows your ad. Right? And for example, if they don't purchase from the top of the search and they also don't purchase from the bottom, but they click on any of your competitor listing to purchase from their listing. So when they click on that listing, they will be able to see your ad inside your competitor listing. So that is the third place where Amazon can actually advertise your product to their buyer so they can actually purchase from your listing, not from your competitor listing. Right? So if you learn about these three placements and if you learn like how Amazon will show your ad to your customer, so it will be so easy for you to manage your PPC campaign effectively when you understand like how Amazon PPC system works and how you can actually use it effectively to get more sales from your Amazon PPC campaign, right? So in this short video, let's learn how Amazon will show your ads to their buyers. So as you can see that this is my one week sales and if I put the filter for past one year, and click on apply so you can see that this is my one year sales you can see that throughout the year i got consistent sales and my sales actually increased in december which was christmas season so around 150k was the revenue and the cool thing about this is that the ppc spend was very less for the lifetime so basically i don't do any magic i only use common sense and use some tips and tricks which i've already explained to you in these videos so if you also want to learn all of those tips tricks and strategies you can just go on my amazon playlist on youtube and learn all the tips for free just to get the revenue like this Alright guys, so as you can see here, I'm on my laptop right now and from here I open Amazon website. So just for an example, if I search for a product, lemon squeezer and click on search. So you can see that if I want that product, lemon squeezer, and then I search for that keyword on Amazon, Amazon will start showing me some products which are from different sellers and I can purchase from any one of the sellers, right? So basically after searching that keyword, I can see the first ad here. You can see that this is a sponsored ad and this ad is for the whole brand. You can see that the brand name is Zule Kitchen and here I can see multiple products from this brand. So this is the first placement, but this placement is not for the sponsored product. This is for the branded product, right? So when we scroll down, so here we can see that these are the advertisement. You can see that they are sponsored product and this is the top of the search. Like this is the place, this is the placement where Amazon will place your ad on top of the search so people can actually purchase your product, right? And if I scroll further down, I can see some other product which are not sponsored product but these products are basically ranking on first page of Amazon organically because they are old seller, they are having good ratings, good quality product and good pricing, right? So these are not the ads, these are organic ranking, right? So as a buyer, if I keep scrolling down, so on the first page, after coming down, down and more down, I can find some other sponsored product. You can see that, first of all, I saw some sponsored product, then I saw some organic product, and then again, at the middle of the page, I can see some sponsored product, right? So basically, these two placements on first page, when customer search for any product, like top of search or middle of the search. So so these are two places where Amazon can actually show your ad, right? So if you adjust your bits and percentage in such a way that Amazon will show your ad on top of the search, so it will show your ad on top of the page. But obviously that kind of ad will be more expensive. And on the other hand, if you optimize your campaigns, 
builds and percentage in such a way that you want Amazon to show your product ad on the middle of the page or bottom of the page. So Amazon PPC will only show your ad on middle of the page or bottom of the page, right? And the same thing goes for the third case, which is product pages. Like for example, your buyer go on Amazon and search for lemon squeezer and they keep scrolling down and they don't click on any of the ad, like not from the top of the search and not from the middle of the search. And they click on any of your competitor listing, which is ranking organically then still you are having the third placement where Amazon can actually show your ad. So if I click on any of the listing from here, just like this one, so you can see that I am on that listing. This is the competitor listing and you can see that they are selling for $13.93 and they have actually got more than 15,000 reviews. But still, if I'm on their listing, if I want to purchase from their listing and if I scroll down, so I can see some other sponsored ad here. You can see that they are sponsored ad and they are basically advertising for the same product on your competitor page. So this is the third placement where Amazon can actually show your ad to your buyer so they can actually purchase from your product, not from your competitor product, if they find your reviews, your price and your quality better than your competitor. Right? So basically these are the placement and this is how Amazon will show your ad to your customer. So if your listing will be good, your pricing will be good and your reviews will be good. So you can actually get more sales from your competitor with the help of Amazon PPC campaign. Because the duty of Amazon PPC campaign is to show your product advertisement to the customer who want to purchase your product. Right? So if you want to learn more about Amazon PPC placement, like if you want to know like from which placement you are getting good sales. So you can actually know your best placement and you can actually adjust your bids and percentage as per that placement. So if you want to do that, so you have to watch my other videos in this playlist in which I have explained you in detail like how you can actually download the placement reports, how you can know like which placement for your product is working best. Like either you are getting good order from top of search or you are getting good sales from product pages. So once you know, you can actually adjust your PPC campaign bids as per that and how to adjust those bids. I have also explained this thing in that video in detail. So if you want to learn that, you can actually check out that video in my playlist or you can search on YouTube how to download Amazon PPC placement report. So you can find my video and from that video, you can actually learn the whole process step by step to find out the best placement for your product and to adjust your PPC campaign to get the more orders from your preferred placement. Right? So go there, watch that video and adjust and optimize your PPC campaign for the best results. So that's it for today guys. I hope you really enjoyed the video and learned something great from it. So if you find my content really informative and helpful for you, then make sure to like the video and subscribe the channel as well. So you can watch more and more videos like this in future. Let's meet in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye. What we do here is go back, back, back.